All right, welcome back to Final Fantasy XIV, and look what I have found. The last Ether card. You just walk up the stairs here, and there it was. All the way over here. Where's that? Uh, the Swallow's Compass. Boom. And there we go. So, let me grab that bad boy on up. And that is all our foot pass for this zone. And then, like the last couple days, we're going to teleport back, waste that gill. But you know what? Sometimes you need to waste it. Now, let's get on to the main story quest line and see if we get lucky enough to get that last ether card. I'm going to say no. I don't think we're, it's time yet. Usually we get it right before we leave a zone. There's got to be something we can do, right? Can't just give up and go home. Not after everything we've been through. A new ruby pit. See? Told you, no ether card. So we get some gear, we get some experience. We're getting some gloves, level 64, we don't need. And we're getting Savage Might Material 5, Determination plus 12. Yuga is troubled by what she has seen. Accepted. Despite everything we have seen and learned, I refuse to renounce this cause. We should return to the house of the fierce and consult with our comrades. Perhaps together we might. You hear that? Quickly, we must find a place to hide. What's going on? What's happening? The Garlinians here. Where did everybody go? Hiding. Please? Someone coming? I didn't hear anything. Hi, me, Tick Man. They come from the south. Oh, snap. What are we doing? What are we doing? Let's wait. Imperials. Why are you milling about like a pack of slack-jawed mongrels? Form a line! Now! Snap. Finally. I come before you today to deliver an announcement of the highest import. So listen well. While on a charitable mission to Isari village, the acting Viceroy and her personal guard came under attack from Confederate forces. This brazen, unconscionable act cannot and will not go unanswered. As loyal subjects of the Empire who enjoy her safety and prosperity, you have a duty to defend her as well. <sighs> there is no cause for alarm. We have no intention of sending ill-trained fodder to the front line. Those who are selected will be expected to perform rudimentary tasks, cleaning and maintenance and so forth. You will serve only as long as you are needed. Afterwards, you'll be free to return to your homes.
You, you first. Taking everybody. <laughs> the Empire has no pressing need of cleaners. This is but a thinly veiled attempt to intimidate those who supported the Confederacy's actions and isolate any whose loyalty they already suspect. And lastly, you. That should suffice for now. Don't worry, I will be back before you know it. Listen to the elders while I'm away, and do not play outside the village. Everything is going to be fine. I love you, all right? Remember that I love you. We thank you for your cooperation. Rest assured that this will all be over very soon, once the Confederacy has been made to pay our own ruby tithe. Wow, they took over half the village. There's no telling what might happen to those people. We have to help them. And we shall. But before all else, we must needs ascertain their destination. I doubt this is the first village the Garleans have visited, nor is it like to be the last. I will track these men. Will you help me? Pray return to our headquarters and tell the others what you saw here. Should we have need of reinforcements, I would know that they are ready. But I should be going with you. I came here to fight! Soon enough, Lise. Soon enough. For now, we must proceed with caution. I know that. I do. It's just... When I saw them rounding those people up... Look, if anything happens, anything at all, you'd better call for us. I mean it, Yugiri. Anything at all. All right, speak with your gig again. Regardless of what the officer claimed, I fear they have cruel designs for these people. With me, Tick Man, we must hurry. All right, let's go. Where are we headed? Right outside of town? Got it. Let's go. All right, Yergi, where you at? We at the gate that no longer works. Yes, you are. It's kind of foggy out there. Oh, now it's right. Oh, she's back in her, her gear. Given the circumstances, we must make every effort to refrain from needless violence. Here. <laughs> It is a shinobi's tool when a more discreet approach is required. Use it with these darts. They are coated with an alchemical reagent that induces a deep sleep. There are soldiers patrolling ahead where circumstances differ 
different, we could have engaged them directly. But for the villagers' sake, we dare not risk it. <clears throat> we will use our blow guns to incapacitate them, regardless of your familiarity with such weapons. You are a veteran warrior, and I am sure it will come naturally to you. Nevertheless, practice is in order. All right, let's practice. There, the soldier on the hill below. Take aim and fire. If the dart finds its mark, he should fall within moments. Search your surroundings for the Imperial Soldier. And then move the camera as well as zoom in and out. Target the soldier and use the blowgun with that button. There it goes. Got him. I wasn't zoomed in enough, I guess. Well done, my friend. Now give me your map. There's a vantage point from which you may observe and fire upon the other soldiers. Worry not. I shall be with you every step of the way, keeping watch for all the patrols. We shall speak again on the other side of the river. <laughs> All right, she's a good ninja. Can I go grab his uh, his junk off of him? There she is. He's a fast ninja as well. Even me in the dust. All right, survey, survey. One. Two. Three. Where's that fifth one? Boom, got him. That quick. They didn't know what hit him. Do I get an achievement for that? The last Imperial soldier crumples to the ground, Steve. You put away your blowgun and prepare to rejoin your. All right, all right, let's go rejoin her. Get out of here, fate. All right, down we go. Where is she? Oh, she must be way over here. Let's go ahead and get some speed going then. Thought she was at the bottom of the hill, but I was mistaken. She's on the other side of the world. Don't, don't, don't. No thanks. No fates for us today. There's my Yogi. Excellent work, man. They appear to be none the wiser. The villagers are being held in the castrum to the south. Pullman's. Once it was the base of operations for the Garlene occupation. Until ten or so years ago, 
when they relocated to Doma Castle. Now the castrum serves as little more than a storage facility. I spied two sentries near the gate. As you have proven yourself to have impeccable aim, I would ask you to incapacitate them. This very hill should afford you a clear shot. So, let's get up to the top of the hill. Let's shoot us some Imperials. Jesus, how do I get up there? Oh, I went all the way around when I was right here. Let's take a look. Surveying, I think I see them down there. Or are they over there? I think they're at that gate. We'll find out in a second. One. Two. Boom, got him. Two sentries slumber side by side. No others appear to be forthcoming. All right, Yergi. Mission accomplished. Ooh, we got some scrap metal right there. Fine work to command. You have a gift for the ways of the shinobi. The way is clear. Let us move closer and see what has become of the villagers. Closer we shall go. Through the gate and through the woods. Hi ho, hi ho, hi ho. Uh oh, music's changed. Sir. The Anne from the other villages are assembled for inspection. Very good. I will address them personally. Attention. Shortly, you will all be transported to the facility on the distant shore. Your duties, as you have been previously informed, will be rudimentary in nature. More specifically, you'll be tasked with the repair and maintenance of various arms and armaments as well as Magitech devices. Magitech? Well, we're farmers. We don't know the first thing about Magitech. It'd take us months, if not years, to learn how to do that kind of work. The material in question was damaged when your kith and kin rose up in rebellion. Therefore, you bear responsibility for its repair. If you cannot perform your duties, you will learn how. And if you cannot learn how, then your village may find themselves at the mercy of the Confederacy and other radical elements. Is that what you want? Sounds all too familiar. Deal with this rabble. I'm needed at the castle. They're about to get shipped out. This is no temporary measure. Those men and women will die in servitude. Once they are taken to the other facility, it will be too late. If we are to intervene, we must do so now. Agreed? Agreed. Then, let us be about it. Oh, and that's it. A new ruby tip. So no gloves for us, and we'll take the Savage Might Materia 5. Complete. Boom. That's another one for the books. And that's it for today. 
So join us tomorrow with The Will to Live. Till then, y'all take care.